Good morning, you guys. It is 8.40 in the morning. Today's Thursday, March 19th. The kids need to put the dishes in the dishwasher. Um, they're still sleeping right now, but I just went through and kind of took out stuff for the day and kind of prep for tomorrow as far as food goes. Um, we have a milk that we went ahead and opened, so I want to make sure we finish it before it goes bad, especially right now. Um, and so I took out the cereal, um, just the different ones that we had open, and then I made some blueberry muffins yesterday, so we can do that for breakfast. I took out some snacks. This is like really low, so I figure my son can go ahead and just snack on that today. We have um, Chex Mix that is open, and then we can snack on some popcorn if we want to. I took out some beans today's thursday um so i can make them today and since tomorrow's friday we're still trying to keep up on the no meat um so on fridays um so i'm gonna go ahead and make some beans today so that we can have bean and cheese burritos tomorrow for lunch um we have some potatoes in the refrigerator and i need to start going through them and we have bacon so i figure we can make some um potato skins for lunch um and then i can leave the rest of the bacon for the weekend for breakfasts and then we have some leftover taco meat and rice from last night so i needed to take out some more of my tortillas i'm just letting those defrost for the kids for dinner tonight and then um there isn't enough for like all four of us so i figure me and my husband will go ahead and i'll do some meatloaf um i have a recipe on this this isn't like your standard meatloaf this is like out of the box one this is actually the only meatloaf that i will eat um so that's the plan for today for food rise okay so i can tell you today's not one of them days where uh we're just gonna get ready okay my husband is gonna be working from home next week um so with that being said what i'm thinking i'm gonna do just so the kids don't always have to keep it down or he doesn't have to go in the bedroom on every single phone call and he's just going back and forth is taking the desk and moving it into the master bedroom and then just putting uh, maybe like one of those end tables over here for my computer it's fine um I'm only really posting once a week right now just because of everything going on. Can't really go out of the house. <laughs> D is up. He's going to be jumping in the shower just to get refreshed. Um, I need to jump in the shower, but I try and work out and then jump in the shower and kind of just somewhat get ready for the day. Um, I've already done 50 squats. I don't think I've said this even on Instagram or anything, but I'm challenging myself to 100 squats a day for 30 days. On Saturday, it will be one week. I've done 100 squats, like low squats, like butt to heel squats. <laughs> um, so I'm trying to go as low as I can and just trying to push myself and challenge myself to 100. I did 50 this morning, um, but I'm gonna get started on lunch i need to wake up nevea at some point it is 11 11. Oh, isn't that when people like make wishes <laughs> why do you look like you're shaking what's wrong are you wagging your tail so i gave him a haircut i showed him on instagram i still need to clean up his face a little bit like around his eyes and we're gonna play this game we played it yesterday if you guys are at home i'm gonna try and link this down on amazon and this thing is so so fun um, so i have washed the potatoes i've poked them i'm gonna place these in the microwave right now and then i have my sous chef aka d cooking <laughs> up the bacon but i like to put these in the microwave and cook them up that way and then it's easier to kind of get like that little scoop out we'll season them um put them in the oven for a little bit and then place the cheese and bacon on top at the end
Okay, so I don't know if you guys could see how I kind of took some out um, of these. So then I took the insides and I just placed it off to the side. Tomorrow I'll do some breakfast patties with this um, with some egg, maybe put in a burrito or something like that for tomorrow, which is Friday. Um, but I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil on this and then some seasoning salt. Okay, so D, I want to move that desk into mom and dad's room. husband is the one that pays the bills and runs our complete household he gets the desk if he's gonna be working from home or he can have the privacy and everything can you bring those bags um, into the laundry room yeah and then you just sit down on the floor <laughs> no, no, but am I right though like dad's the one that well yeah but then like, also too like instead of staying on the floor you have a laptop right you can always put it on laptops. the laptop. You can always, like, you know, mm -hmm. put it on there. You can sit down and mm -hmm. put your headphones in. Mm -hmm. So you're not sitting on the floor. He doesn't want me sitting on the floor. I I'm don't. like, it's one video a week that I'm posting. It's fine. <laughs> and he's like, no, I don't want mama sitting on the floor. So I just need to clean that. And then we'll bring in a chair. And then he has a place to work now. Okay, so now I'm going to get our cheese. And then we have our bacon right there. Okay, you guys, and lunch is served. We're gonna do this. We have fruit, yogurt, and then we're gonna bake some cookies after this. So, Nevaeh wanted some orange juice. We have oranges, so she's squeezing it herself. I'm gonna put some sugar in there, too. Just make it a little sweeter. No. No, I'm saying, like, it's like, she's like, ah, oh, it's like a little. Do you want me to cut that in half? It's okay. So she's making her own orange juice. So we have YouTube pulled up, and I'm gonna go to a, Nevaeh doesn't know what I'm doing, a drawing thing. So he's gonna go step by step, drawing, Danny's washing his hands right now, 
and you guys are gonna try and step by step and draw what he's drawing. And then when daddy comes home, we're gonna ask him <laughs> who drew it better without him knowing who's is who. It's like okay. Though. I'm like a mini Pokemon. Oh. Okay, so this is called Art for Kids Hub and they will go step by step on how to draw it. And so we're gonna see how well the kids do. Are you ready? Yeah? <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. Wait, we need markers. I know, well let's just draw it first and then we'll color them in. I think. Okay, so round one, I can't remember if I told you guys, round one, Bob Ross himself. <laughs> we got Nevea so I'm far. On the side. I'm like, oh. And we got Danny's is so far. So let's see. <laughs> So we're snacking on yogurt, blueberry muffins. Nevea will hold off on her blueberry muffin. They ended up just pulling it up on their phone because the TV was kind of like stalling, no miles. So what else goes better with a drawing and art than cookies? So we're gonna go to bake some cookies. I have the meatloaf finishing up in there and it is 2.51, doing good for the day. Okay, they just told me that they are done. Let's see. I hate the eyes. He looks good though. Good job, Danny, before my battery dies. <laughs> and he put a LV, Louis Vuitton, and couplings. Gucci. One, two, <laughs> three. <laughs> he didn't even like it before. Quiet, Miles. <laughs> Six, seven. Stop. <laughs> Hold on, you got no voiceover? I'm gonna keep that in. <laughs> okay, you're gonna be just gonna be huge. <laughs> <laughs> Son's being a smart butt back there. What? But My body's amazing. amazing. Got cookies. The beans are still going. This is now clean, so I'm gonna open it up so it can cool down for <laughs> you guys to unload it. <laughs> oh. So. I can get a knife out <laughs> and start chopping up the spaghetti squash to get that done. Do 20 more squats. I'm gonna go take a shower. Okay, so I've shown this many times. I just cut that up into four pieces, a cup of water and down at the bottom. We're gonna close her up. I need to wipe this down, it's from the dishwasher, but uh, pressure cook, five minutes works and that's it. And this is in day four of quarantine. <laughs> so my husband is home, so pick a winner. This is Bob Ross, by the way. Oh, okay. So they're like cartoon characters. So I like both. The the one that I like. Oh, they're both hard. It's hard. <laughs> you have to point to it so that people could see too. I, I like this one. But I like this one too. What I like about this one it's like like it's colored and it's like a little bit more compact. But I think what I like about this one is just it's bigger. Okay, so, so out of the two, that one? This one. Okay. Okay, okay put that one off to the side. But now we have bunny. Um, I'll go with this one. Okay. And now we have marshmallow on fire. I like this one. Okay. <laughs> so we have <laughs> Nevea, <laughs> Danny, and Danny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like I like this one because it's big, but I like the other one because of the color. I like this one because it looks more like it's smiling. 
<laughs> then the other one looks like it's like sad, like it's had a sad day, like it's like <laughs> lost. And then this one looks like a bunny, and this one looks like it, it like it, it looks sad because it doesn't know if it's a cat or a rabbit or whatever. <laughs> and then I like this one because of color, like it looks pretty cool. Like, the shading yeah. and everything, huh? Yeah, that's what, like what I liked about this one is because it had the color, you know? Mm -hmm. That's all I was like, oh, but I like this one because it was just, maybe because it was just bigger. Good job, kids. Good job. Good job, dad. <laughs> I'm being the voter. Okay, so I have my husband's lunch ready for tomorrow. So we just ended up putting pesto in the spaghetti squash. And then I just crushed up some almonds to put on top because he likes to have some crunch. So, Nevea, saw, where did you see this? I think I saw some, like, I'm not sure. I forgot. But, like. Okay, hold on. So we have a warmer. Yeah. But we don't have any melts or the ones that sh I like. <laughs> Yeah. Um, so what she's doing is she's lighting the candles, she's letting the wax melt, and then okay. what you do is you get some water and then you blow out the flame, pour the wax into the water, and then it like hardens. hardens. And then, then you, you can put get it, on it out, a paper towel, break it up, dry it off, break it up, and then you can put it in this. And then the way it's like is, it'll form into this like a little shape. So, and then you can go ahead after it melts into that shape she can take it pop it out and she's going to put it in here so then she has her own melts so she went ahead and poured it <laughs> so anyway she pours it in here and it hardens yeah so you're going to break it up into these pieces i see so why don't you pour it when it's hot in here why don't you pour when it's melted wax in there and then it'll harden in the shape versus hardening it then make it melt again do you know what i mean yeah maybe i'll try that i feel like i'm like a witch like a witch <laughs> mixing up potions and stuff like that so I'm gonna okay so now we just took that out we'll come back to that later put that on the towel stop oh you're doing a big one yeah. Okay, now put that in the fridge or freezer so then it can harden, then you can pop it out. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Okay, so Nevea just got it out of the freezer. Just like that. Dump it upside down on the towel. Let's hope this comes out. It's one piece. Oh. Uh, it's okay, you have two okay. melts. So put it back in the freezer. It's gonna pop out. Oh. Oh, look at that. So she has, let me see the other one. Two melts that she can place in here. Yeah, that was the bottom, so place that upside down. Two melts that she can place in there with scents that she likes, and we don't have to buy them because we already have the candles. And you have a lot. So we'll see how many she ends up with at the end.